Good morning and welcome to the Camp Ugotawana Morning Announcements. Today is Monday, October 8th, 2018. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and the McGuffey Mission Statement. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. We are at McGuffey to be respectful, responsible, engaged, and safe in all settings of our school so we can learn and be our best. You may be seated. Our preschool through fourth grade students will be having French toast sticks with syrup, a sausage patty, hash brown potato with ketchup, chilled vegetable juice, and cinnamon apple slices. Our fifth through eighth grade students will be having French toast sticks with syrup, a sausage patty, potato triangles with ketchup, chilled vegetable juice, and chilled diced pears or fresh fruit. Just a reminder that after school begins today, so students, if you are in after school, remember that when we start dismissal, you will wait in your classroom for someone from the after school program to come get you. Please do not leave your classroom to go look for your after school teacher. You will stay in your classroom until someone from the after school program comes and gets you. This week is Nonviolence Awareness Week. And we look forward to honoring Nonviolence Awareness Week all week long, but especially tomorrow, which is Tuesday. Um, Minnie Jean Brown Tricky is a civil rights activist and part of the Little Rock Nine, which helped desegregate public schools. And she will be at McGuffey on Tuesday to present to a group of students that have been studying her work. This program will take place in the gym for most of the day tomorrow. We are so excited for this program and honored that she is coming to talk to some of our students here at McGuffey. A huge thank you to Mrs. Yancey and Mr. Ellis for putting this program together. Wednesday is PSAT testing for our eighth grade students. Eighth graders, this is your big first step to preparing for high school, college, and whatever kind of education or career path you pursue after high school. We know that you will do your best and you will work hard. Students, we will be resuming interviews for grades 5 through 8 today for leadership during your special times. So please be patient and we will get to everyone this week for their leadership interviews. Students and teachers, since it is October, we are now starting to look for another student of the month for each classroom. This month's characteristic will be based on responsibility. One example of being responsible is doing the things that you're supposed to do, such as completing your homework and turning it in on time. Let's see who can be the most responsible student in each class this month. We only have one birthday today, so I want to give a huge shout out and happy birthday to Lily Morrison in fourth grade. If anyone sees Lily today, please wish her a very happy birthday. And we will end with her quote of the day. It is, nonviolence is a weapon of the strong. So we are excited to honor nonviolence week all week this week. And we will see you all tomorrow on Tuesday for the Camp You Gotta Wanna morning announcements.